Hey everyone, Ralph Vincent here from Simply Saratoga Magazine. When you're having friends over for cocktails, of course you're going to want to have something yummy for them to nibble on along with their drinks. I have got a recipe for you today that's the perfect cocktail nosh. It's a dip that is so flavorful and so easy to put together. You're going to love it. It's called tzatziki. It's a Middle Eastern condiment actually that's usually made up of yogurt, garlic, cucumber, and some other flavorings. I think it's fantastic with cocktails and it's so easy to do. We'll get started right now. In my mixing bowl, I have probably a cup and a half of fat-free plain Greek style yogurt. You can use full fat Greek style yogurt if you'd like to. I really don't think it makes much difference in this recipe, so I like to save the calories. Then we're gonna add our cucumber. What I have here is one half of an English cucumber that I've coarsely grated on my box grater. I like English cucumbers a lot. I like their flavor, their skins are very thin, and you don't even have to peel them. The important thing to remember though is you've gotta get all the water out of the cucumber. So I've got this in a clean dish towel, and just what you need to do, and don't do this with paper towels, they'll fall apart, is just give this a good squeeze, and you'll get all the water out of there, otherwise you're gonna have a very soggy dip. All right, we've got that, and now we're just gonna drop that in here. Okay, put that to one side. To that, we're gonna add two tablespoons of chopped fresh dill and a clove of garlic that's been minced. And we'll get these guys all in there. Then we're gonna add two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil for a little flavor, a little richness. Two tablespoons of fresh lemon juice to brighten things up a little. And finally, a little seasoning. I've got half a teaspoon of pink Himalayan sea salt. I love pink Himalayan sea salt when I use it anytime with a recipe with vegetables that aren't going to be cooked. Also have in here a pinch of freshly ground black pepper and a pinch of white pepper. So in we go with those. We're gonna give this a quick mix. This comes together so quickly. Uh, you wanna make sure after you mix this that you put it in the refrigerator for about an hour before you serve it so that all the flavors get a chance to meld together. All right, we'll give this another couple of turns here. Yeah, that looks good. All right, let me grab a serving dish for this. All right, let's put this in here and I'll show you what we've got. There we go, oh, that looks so good. Fresh, flavorful, um, light nonetheless too. It's not, not something heavy to serve with drinks, it's great. There we go, let me get rid of that bowl. And there you have it, tzatziki. Simple, delicious, your guests are gonna love it. Now, I like to serve this with some wedges of fresh pita bread, which I have here. You can also do a lot of different things. You can serve it with crackers, chips, fresh vegetable dippers. The sky's the limit. I hope you'll give this recipe a try. I'll be back again soon with more fun recipes. In the meantime, check me out in Simply Saratoga Magazine and simplysaratoga.com. Look for Entertaining with Ralph Vincent. In the meantime, remember, have fun in your kitchen, enjoy cooking for the people you love, and don't stress yourself out. Whatever you're making, food, cocktails, whatever, remember, it doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to taste good. See you soon.